inside the all-new 2023 Volkswagen ID Buzz. Volkswagen's new bus marks an electric milestone, the move from mainstream to niche. The Volkswagen ID Buzz was unveiled at their auto plant in Wolfsburg, Germany on March 9, 2022, and took almost 20 years because of a step change with driving technology which lead them into scandals about diesel emissions as well as geopolitical gas crises that made people not want anything too technological or foreign but now they're back baby. Volkswagen thrilled the world Wednesday with its new retro bus, an electric vehicle that will be able to travel anywhere. The ID Buzz looks like it came straight out of 1985 and can even fit surfboards inside. It's not available yet, but we're sure people aren't waiting long before they buy one when it goes into production later this year or early next. The camper van is an iconic vehicle for road trips and has been around since the 1930s. With its large exterior side-by-sides, it can easily reach speeds over 46 miles per hour due to their high ground clearance which makes them great on dirt roads or mountain highways, where other vehicles would get stuck fast in soft terrain making this type of driving much more dangerous than modern-day cars with four-wheel drive capabilities, even though they're slower overall, because there isn't any electronic control like you find nowadays that helps maintain traction while going through upgrades such as rain gear, tire warmers etc. Whether you're a weekend warrior or an adventure seeker, van life is for everyone who's looking to take their life and adventures on the road. The number van lifers aren't just commuting, they're heading out into nature with all its beauty and terror unencumbered by wires. Secondly, vans are not, and have never really been, hot selling vehicles. Last year Americans bought just 311k minivans which is a rounding error in Detroit compared to their peak of almost 500,000 five years ago. More than 70 years after its introduction, the VW bus is still going strong. With over 7 million made in an exhausting supply in America following 2003, when production was stopped due to our own safety regulations, not because of any other countries, enthusiasts are paying top dollar for their treasured classics today. With electric cars on the rise, car companies are starting to take note. The Wolfsburg plant has been working overtime in order to produce more of these vehicles, and it seems as though they've finally found success with their newest lineup. A lot can happen within a year, from bad news such as decreased sales for gas-powered models like Buick Cascada, which only had 3% market share last year, all the way up until amazing breakthroughs like this recent development involving Tesla Motors CEO Elon Musk founding his own company called Hyperloop which plans provide transportation through tube technology between Los Angeles and San Francisco via pods carrying passengers or cargo inside aluminum tubes welded. It's been 21 years since Volkswagen teased concepts of a new microbus for their iconic vehicle. The fifth CEO in that span finally decided to steer one into production and give competitors time, but over the last few years there have still been many attempts from other brands step up with EV technology as they see how well promoted this segment has become lately due, largely because companies like Tesla are killing off traditional gas cars altogether, while going hard on evolved versions such as an SUV or compact utility vehicles instead, something which may soon be coming our way here at Automotive News Europe. Within the store list for all things electric confronting a brewing gas crisis, the green lighting of strange ideas will be fast and frequent. Rivian produced their first electric pickup truck just last year. Porsche has given us an amazing battery-powered station wagon, and this is only going to get weirder from here as more people begin lusting after those who can afford such luxury items in order to avoid fuel shortages or price spikes at convenience stores near you soon enough too. Consider the Polestar O. It's a tiny electric sports car with its own autonomous drone that can be slung skyward and ordered to follow car, providing always on coverage from behind glass as you drive through your day or night. This vehicle is purpose built for those who want nothing more than total immersion in their driving experience. Whether distance 0%, standing still, extreme turns at high speeds along mountain roads where every millisecond counts, because there's no one else around but nature herself, or even taking off into thin air without anyone else knows what happened until seconds later, when they see footage displayed upon YouTube screens worldwide. There is also a possibility that the all-new Volkswagen ID Buzz will get five or maybe six different versions. These versions will be the ID Buzz Pro, ID Buzz Pure, ID Buzz Cargo, ID Buzz Long Wheelbase, ID Buzz California's production. There might also be other versions in the future, but for now, only time can tell. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.